I could write you a million motivational quotes. I could show you a thousand before and afters. I could create the best and most effective workouts designed especially for you. But the truth is, you have to understand that if you do not listen when your body whispers, you will hear it scream. You need to understand we all have only one life, one body, and a million reasons to keep it fit and healthy. Here are my reasons. What are yours? And how bad you want it. The distance between dreams and reality is called action. Hello, my friends. This is Fitness Anytime and Anywhere by Marzina. Today, 10 best aqua pilates exercises with resistance ankle calves, all in the standing position. Good news for those who maybe don't like or cannot swim. Yeah, that definitely must be a great idea. Well, if you incorporated these amazing resistance ankle cups that I hope to convince you to purchase right now, immediately after you watch all those exercises, you're gonna take your routine to the next level. Now to order your set, follow this affiliate link and shop straight from my store where I picked for you blue medium or black heavy. Be sure you can handle heavy ones because they can be quite challenging. Guys, this is just a quick list. To enjoy the entire full-length 90-minute video, you have to subscribe to On Demand Aqua Workout platform. Here's your link and you're also going to have it in the description. Let's go to the list. Firstly, standing side-to-side -side toe taps. This one I love to add to the warm-up because this is how we just get going comfortable with air and water temperature nothing really intensive that's not what we are here for with pilates tap it out and drag your hand to the other side then ooh, hip circles yes standing feet shoulder width apart with your toes pointed forward knees slightly bent you're gonna circle your hips all the way to your right any arm moves will do and then don't forget to reverse this exercise by the way is great before you do some water dance <laughs> number three let's walk forward three steps and backward you're gonna end it up this last step with nice front lift now at the beginning you may want to do high knee like you see on the little screen but eventually you can upgrade and finish with big front lift forward with slight torso rotation 
and then big lift at the end of that short walk. I want you to notice I'm not rounding my back. I'm not bending forward to reach to my toes. You need a little bit of flexibility to actually touch that toe. And if you don't have, don't worry about it. Just reach toward your knee or toward your toe. And at one point, once those muscles are ready, you're going to see a huge progress. Now, notice this is asymmetrical exercise. So you have to repeat firstly this stuff on your right and then on your left. The best water level for this and most of the exercises on this list would be somewhere with water reaching to your chest, not deeper. I know for many of you, it will be tempting to go deeper to your shoulders, but as of having 20 plus years of experience, I'm telling you, you are gonna waste your time. Number four, fire hydrant with diamond jumps eventually oh love it <laughs> so keep that leg bent you want to see close to 90 degree point flex uh, behind your knee and when you do diamond jabs jumps make sure you exhale try keep your feet your ankles together with that jump use your arms to absorb a little bit of the impact that actually this jump creates notice i'm not jumping up and down i only tuck those knees to the side love this exercise and love it so much that sometimes i repeat it over and over again especially if i have those ankle calves available now if you notice you get bored with it, I recommend you start turning around like you see me going, or you can move a little bit forward and backward. Good, good stuff, my friends. Watch me again. It's very important, then, guys, when we practice Pilates, whether it is in a water or not, we focus not only on number of repetitions, but we really pay attention to our form. This is very crucial. So when you do this or any other exercise, stay nice and tall. Pull your belly in, drag those shoulders back and away from your ears. You kind of want to look like ballerina a little bit. And you're going to feel such a difference. Did you see what I just did? I actually added split jumps. So fire hydrant, diamond jumps and split jumps is our number five. And I'm not gonna lie, I like this one even better. Check this out. Drag your hands forward and kick your legs to the side. Good stuff, my friends. Watch me again. 90 degree point flex behind that knee. Let's go all out. Here's your diamond jump and ooh, ready? Aich! Love it. And guess what? You're gonna love it too. <laughs> Number six. Great mix of aqua jacks and cross country skiing. This one is without knee tacking. Do you know what I mean by that? Your feet will stay very close to the bottom of the pool. Yes, you can go slower or faster, but notice there's no jumping up and down or tacking knees, moving those feet up. Not that it would be incorrect, I just believe that if you want to do a Pilates, we really want to choose versions that work those deep core muscles. And this is one of the way we can do it. Hey, by the way, if you are enjoying this video so far, give it a like, comment below. Definitely let me know which one from this list is your favorite one. And then I hope you're gonna subscribe to my channel because guys, I want nothing more but this community to grow bigger and stronger. Let's make it the biggest aqua class on earth. Are you ready for more? Number seven, woohoo! Let's walk again forward with front lift, but now we're gonna switch that back lift for back top or back leg extension. So watch again. Here's your front lift. You see, I'm touching my toes with the opposite hand. I walk back. It's not easy. Trust me, it's not. Lift or tap. Now, when I do front lift, I keep my shoulders down and right above hips. 
but when I do back lift, which you will see in a moment when we're gonna add a side view, I'm leaning a little bit forward to protect my lumbar spine right here, you see it? This is extremely important because you can actually put unnecessary stress to the lumbar spine. You may not feel any pain or discomfort when you do it, but I can pretty much guarantee you, you will feel it eventually. And I want no pain for you, my friends. It's important that you know how to do these moves correctly. So that is why I'm talking to so much. Number eight, let's walk forward and then backwards with side lifts. Now, this cannot be just any side lift. I want you to point your toes like a ballerina again and lift up this leg as far out to the side as you can without moving the other foot above the ground. So I know you can't see my feet here, but my feet are grounded, sticking to the floor. Do not climb up on your toes. This is cheating. We all don't like it, right? Any arm moves will do. Notice I'm crossing my feet behind, heading backward, and then I cross forward, heading forward. Like it. Oh yeah, number nine. What? Standing diamonds. It's actually jumping diamonds. Jog it out a little bit. I want your full attention, my friends. Look what's happening now. Yes, we are tucking those knees out, keeping toes together. Good stuff, my friends. Now, for those of you who are not swimmers, you can do this in a standing position, tucking one leg out at a time. Now, you won't be able to go as fast as you just saw me going, obviously. <laughs> That's me editing videos, but this is a real tempo and really the best tempo is when you are able to fully exhale with every single jump number 10 side lunge with knee up waist water level would be absolutely best for this one now you're gonna see this exercise from the side view in a moment with lift which is a progression because if you would love to do the entire workout with me please check out on demand aqua platform i've created 90 minute water pilates video with these bad guys resistance ankle calves where i'm teaching you how to do each exercise correctly motivating supporting really just telling you exactly how it's supposed to be done Right now you can see some of the moves on the screen. I will make another list of those for you, for sure, in the future. So this is the link. I hope you're gonna check this out. And I cannot wait to share all of that with you. Which exercise was your favorite? I cannot wait to hear from you. Bye now.